Hammer as the time's first dentist. Um, he was the first dentist to be in some time. It's been to the whole of the valley. So he had to travel up north to visit his patients. Um, and uh, on this journey, he uh, saw what was happening to the old, um, the old farming community uh, because of the Industrial Revolution. The agriculture uh, and the farms in, in, uh, in Norway, they were being industrialized, more machines were in use which was changing also this and then you put the sod on top to keep the birch bark in place but of course the sod has grass and small plants growing on it with roots and that could grow through the birch bark and then falls and then of course it's no longer waterproof so in order to prevent this you put the first layer of soil with the grass turned down that of course will rot and so you get this sort of nice mushy layer in between the birch bark and the topmost layer of the soil with the grass turned upwards. Um, and uh, that way, you, the, the, the grass and now the raspberry plants uh, will uh, have their roots sort of growing into the smushy layer, but it will not go and grow into, oh. into the birch bark. Uh, and in the northern part of this valley, it doesn't rain any more than it does in Sahara. So uh, there, you would not have uh, a big problem of this rotting within the first hundred years or so. In fact, they would open, it would be between 80 and 120 years uh, from the time they first uh, attached the roof uh, to the next time they had to replace it. Anywhere, anywhere you want to sit, it's yours. It's not on the table. Oh, on the table you can sit. You get good, good quality, well, shit to put on the wheels. Yeah? Okay. That's a very Valley, um, and then throughout the 1700s, most people uh, got a chimney. Of course, with the exception of the house that we went to before. Um, and once, once you have the chimney, you get rid of the smoke immediately. But you don't have the light coming in from the smoke vent, so you also need windows. And luckily, from 1744, we have had glass production in Norway, which meant that you no longer have to import windows, and it becomes more available. Um, here we have uh, rather big windows, um, and you even have a window in the middle. Part of the work on the farm in this valley, spread the water out onto the fields. Otherwise, nothing would grow. Uh, okay. Yeah. Thank you. 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 Thank and the reason I did this um, is that the farms in Norway, they are rather small. They have lots of land that's not arable, that's not, you know, very good for, for fields and, and growing crops. And so the land closest to the farm, which is down in the valley, that farm... Longer, one meter, one meter. 